Hey everybody, what's going on? Your host AMF1534 here. Welcome back to Let's Play Some More Ghost Pilots, and I totally almost didn't even make that. <laughs> it was way too close! But we got it, and now we're dead. But it's all good. <laughs> so now, imagine being one of the kids living down there in that residential neighborhood, and you look up in the sky, and there's like 50 planes just blowing each other up to absolute no end up there. Like, Daddy, come look at this! Everybody's dead! Yeah! <laughs> Well, son, you better go back inside. You don't want to see a giant plane in your lawn. If you remember watching that episode of Breaking Bad where the plane ends up in uh, Walt's pretty much his backyard, then you, you know what that was like, so... Get the fuck inside, Jimmy! It's just not a good idea to be out there! However, this is really cool to watch. <laughs> fuck. So, we are in... Uh, the last set of levels. We, we finally went back to the little mini-menu thing there after we got through some more stuff. Oh god, a boss fight in this area? Oh, I guess not. Never mind. Or maybe it is. Oh god. Okay, well at least we're in the clouds. We're not just right over their face. Oh no. Two, another another little uh, double boss thing, huh? Oh no. No, we're just gonna fight the big one. Um, yeah, so we're in this last area, the area on the, on the little uh, menu thing that had the you know, the question mark, blah 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 That's what we're dealing with right now. So, I had something really weird happen today, and, and I've not actually had this happen before at work, and so it kind of really took me, it kind of took me by surprise when I saw it, but, so I'm, I'm, god damn it, I really need to stop doing that. I just have this weird thing where I can't not shoot. I just, I, I can't help myself. Even though I know not, I know better than to shoot those damn things, I just keep doing it anyways, and every time I do, I die. Every time. I'm sitting here proving my theory as it happens. Because I should probably should be shooting at these things. Um, but I am, so I'm, I'm working earlier this morning, and uh, this lady comes in with, one, with, you know, one of her friends or whatever. And, uh, you know, they're just shopping around, no big deal, and I wasn't really paying attention to either one of them. But as they were getting ready to leave, I went to go ask. The, uh, I went to go ask them if they were finding everything okay. And uh, one of the ladies ended up buying something. But the other lady, she um, she was definitely just walking around in my store carrying a gun on her hip. Not even kidding. She just had a. She had just like a regular, like a regular handgun, in a holster, just chilling on her hip like it was no big deal. And I'm looking at that. I'm like, hold on, just this, like, is this mirror? Is this really weird? Like. People typically aren't just carrying guns around uh, these days, especially with all the gun control stuff they're t they've been talking about anymore, but... Yeah, dude, this lady was just, like, straight up just carrying a gun, walking around. Like, she was super nice. Like, she wasn't, like... Like, when I saw her carrying it, like, I wasn't like, oh my god, she's gonna shoot up the place. I was just like, huh, she's got a gun on her. That's, that's kind of weird. But, yeah, dude, it was, it was weird. It was, it was interesting. Like, I didn't question her about it, because I didn't want to, like... I didn't want to make it, like, seem like it was making me uncomfortable, because, I mean, technically it really wasn't. Like, I, w I didn't have, like, a big problem with it or anything. But, yeah, and so I was, like, trying to sit there, I was, like, sitting there wondering, maybe she was, like, an undercover cop. Oh, no, there's more to this fight than this, huh? I guess I should have known after he, you know, went and dropped these things out in the clouds. It's all right, though, we're gonna, we're gonna take him out. <laughs> Not like a blow-off valve on a street racer, it's like... <laughs> Whoa, hello. Jeez. Um. Ooh, I barely, barely got an extra life out of that. Uh, yeah, so it, it was interesting. You, I mean, you, just, you don't see people go into a health food store toting a gun around on their on their hip. And, like, it wasn't even hidden at all. Like, she wasn't dressed like a police officer or anything that would have really, that should have made me think that. But, uh, like, she just had, like, a, you know, like a, like a nice, kind of like a, just like a regular dress on. And, uh, you know, she kind of looked a little, like, kind of business formal a little bit, but I was just like, huh, this is just strange. So yeah, there was that, there was my random run-in with, uh, with a gun-toting lady today. That was certainly an experience I've not had before. Come on, come on, come on, come on! Come on, baby! Take him down! There you go. One down, now we gotta get the other one. Which, he's not in the greatest shape either, he's, he's a little bit, he's a little bit fiery. Okay, let's add another quarter here. We gotta be getting close to the end of this game. There's, I mean, we have when we have to fight three people 
in the course of one boss fight, then you know that you're you gotta be getting close to the to the old the big guy. There we go. Now he's dead. Or they are all dead. They were all dead. Da 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 blah 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 opening Max Payne dialogue, blah blah. I love these old spice commercials, by the way. Holy crap, they didn't even give me any warning there. These old spice commercials are just funny. Like, I know they're probably really annoying to a lot of people just because of the the gross frequency that they play them, but I don't know. I, I think they're kind of clever. Like, I'm not going to sit here and tell you that I'm not annoyed by them, too, because I kind of am. But, I don't know. I think they're funny, especially the one with the, uh, like, the Asian lady at the bowling alley, uh, where she, like, she's, like, hiding out behind the pins watching her son, and then she... She has like that creepy, that kind of creepy voice. Old Spice, look what you've done! You've made a sexy man right out of my son, Old Spice. Do -do 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 -do. I love that one. That and the one where like it's like the compilation of moms following their sons around with like the lady that's like sliding around in the laundry basket on the on the back of the car, and then uh, the one that's like hiding in the curtains, and the one that comes up out of the out of the uh, the couch cushion, which is really scary, by the way. I don't really know how I feel about that particular one. And then the lady that's like, yeah, she's like hiding in the curtains with a couple of eye slots cut out. Like, what the fuck are they doing in there? He better not be touching her vagina. I told him better than that. I told him there were demons in her pants. He didn't listen to me. Oh, boy. So much going on here. I mean, this, this game has absolutely kicked my ass, but, you know... We're, we're doing okay. I kind of wish that they would have uh, kind of used some more songs in this game. Like, I can only think of, like, a couple different themes that they used in here. And really, they, they kept that down to an absolute minimum. Which is okay. I mean, I, I guess they, they wanted to focus a little bit more on the absolute insane number of on-screen enemies instead of having a diverse soundtrack. But that's alright. I mean, there have definitely been games in the world that have had good soundtracks with just one song playing. I, I can't name them off at you right at, at this time. If you were if you were waiting for that, like, well, what is he talking about? Well, I can't tell you right now. I just I just I know that it's happened before. That's all. That's all I know. Oh, God! What the hell's going on out here? Chill out. Fuck. I mean, I can't even like. Ugh! I'm sitting here trying to build up at least a little bit of a respectable score here, and I just can't do it. I can only imagine over the course of this game, like, if they, if, if this was the kind of game that, like, continues to tally your score instead of resetting it every time you insert a credit, I kind of wonder what our, what our actual, like, a, like, cumulative score would have been over the course of this, because it, it would have been a lot. Like, we've had at least 100,000 a whole bunch of times in this. So I've got to imagine we could have, we could have been, you know, in the... Maybe like the 2 million percentile, maybe more? Who knows? God. I also wish these planes would just move a little bit faster. That That's kind of been like my one big grievance. I don't. I, I know I've mentioned it a while back, but that's that's been like the one thing that's really kind of gotten under my skin a little bit is that. Because there's a lot of times where I could have, you know, had it been a different game, I, God, I could have probably evaded these uh, some of these, you know, impending doom moments had I just been able to move a little bit faster, but, I mean, I guess these planes obviously aren't going to be the most maneuverable thing in the world. I mean, we're not going to be doing, you know, fucking all these crazy acrobatic stunts with them. Alright, come on. Oh my god! I'm trying. I, I really am. I know that I've died an absolute shit ton in this series, but I'm, I'm really giving this my best shot. It's just... In a lot of cases, in a lot of cases, it's a lot harder than it looks, and it looks hard. <laughs> if that's saying a lot right there, which I think it is. Oh, good. Giant cracks in the cement. Oh my God! Look how big this tank is! Holy smokes! I know there's a lot more to that tank than what we're seeing right now. There. Oh boy. Oh shit! I didn't mean to do that. I mean, I did. It's not like I totally didn't mean to do that. Come on, come on, come on. I like how when you use bombs, I never really noticed it until now, but I love that the bombs kind of shake the screen a little bit. I think that's kind of a cool little a little thing. Oh, no. Oh! 
God, I finally evade those things and I still get killed, which would also mean that I didn't evade them. Come on, well, there you go, one flamethrower gone. It's kind of weird, like, that scenario where they shoot all those things out, it's actually better that we shoot them, because it seems to be pretty easy to maneuver away from them. Come on, go away, there you go. There we go, now things are blowing up. Things are going the right way now. Okay, here we go. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, oh yeah. Button mashing joy. Yeah, oh no. Okay, just gotta take these. I'm gonna bite each one of these fingers off one at a time. Or not. I guess we're not gonna do that at all because we're. No, no. We're just going to move way. What the hell is this? God, this is way too much. And I still have to deal with these stupid little things down here. Oh my god, that is that is so cheap. They like don't even give you enough time to blow these things up down here, yet they still expect you to be able to avoid that on top of this whole mess of things. Okay, here we go. We're we're oh my lord Jesus. Oh boy. Oh boy. Man, this is like the ultimate arsenal. Why does the US Army not have these these types of tanks? <laughs> Aside the fact that they would cost like a quadzillion dollars. A quadzilla! It would cost an absolute nation's fortune to buy one of these things. Okay, and there's still more. If if you could actually believe that there was more to this tank than what we've already seen. Ah. Okay, we're we're gonna we're gonna take these things out real quick here. I think. I'd like to think we were, but no, no, no. These these little tiny turret things on the front are extremely resilient. Okay, that's 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 the old the heart of the tornado here. Just gotta take that thing out, and everything else is gonna go with it. Oh no! Oh no! You don't. Yeah, I have to. I have to exhibit some patience here that didn't work. <laughs> I'm trying, damn it! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! It's really weird when you like fire off a bomb and then you start shooting while the bomb's going off. It kind of makes your bullets look like forks. You might have to go back and look at that because I'm not gonna. Well, actually, we're gonna do it right now. See, look, it kind of they kind of look like they're pronged a little bit, more like pitchforks instead of regular forks. But y you get the general idea there. Okay, looks like we have found a little system that works here. Oh god, okay, here we go. Ah, oh, damn it. We finally get something that works, and then I go and ruin it for myself. Come on, baby, we're gonna take this thing out right now. I will not end this until you're dead! Oh no, we're getting some crazy lag going on right now. There we go. Now it's gone. Ah! So just me or do these little turret things on the side keep getting, like, closer? It's either that or maybe I'm just, like, not... Maybe it's a timing thing. Maybe I've just been able to avoid them for most of the time because I've been, you know, they've been coming by at a certain time where I can dodge them easier. Oh, no. Come on, here we go. God, this thing has an incredible amount of health. I mean, I guess it is a tank we're fighting after all. They're supposed... They want you to take the rolls! Okay. Come on, please let that be the final blow. It is not. Okay. How about this one? Nope. All the bombs in the world won't blow this thing up. At least not yet. Come on. Man, this is just a this is a marathon right now. This is the actual battle of marathon. Oh boy. It's crazy, like, the actual fiery ball things that it shoots out are almost more dangerous than when you shoot them apart. That's the that's the weird thing. Like, normally it's been the other way around for that the entire time. But they're they're so close together when you don't shoot them apart that it's it's actually kinda hard to dodge them. Like when you shoot them apart, they're they they spread out so much. God, dude, this thing has an immense amount of health. This is crazy. 
However, this may be the longest amount of time that I've been alive for any one, um, you know, any one sitting in this game. Oh, ouch. But that's okay, we got some bombs. I got my baby back, baby back, baby back, baby back, bombs. Hey! Come on, hurry up and die already! How many more times do I have to drop a bomb on your ass? Jeez, I'm crow. Cheese and crackers. Cracker barrel. Banana Republic, you know? Please. You you don't have a lot more in the tank. I'm just... I, I know you. Even though I've never played this game before, I just... I know that you don't. You're, you're a liar. You're just a big old fat liar. I mean, how many bombs can that turret withstand? It is incredible. You know what? I'm gonna kill myself just so I can get my bombs back. <laughs> I mean, that's like the only way to take this damn thing out and to do any. S there, yeah! You can't handle it, man! You can't! I am an immortal! I mean, I'm sure the guy that, that was dry. Wow! All stage clear! Yeah! We got a million points! Yeah! Or 10 million points, even! Hooray! We have won forever! A little bit anticlimactic, but you know, I will take that because because America, you know, America wins against the nondescript enemy that I don't know who it was, but it was. That's all that matters. It was, and we get Ghost Fi. Nothing like a good old-fashioned Ghost Ghost Fighter brand liquor with cracked sunglasses. Yeah, we save the world or this one province from Eric Kawasaki and Tama. Yeah, that guy's name is Yo. Mr. SNK26. Papaya made the sound. All right. Guys, we won. It actually happened. This is cool. This this game was a lot of fun. I know I know that I got really pissed off a lot over this. Wait, hope you can see our next game. Did they make a Ghost Pilot 2? Or uh, yeah, did they make a second one of these or did it like get poured into another series? I don't even know. Well, I had a blast with this. I hope you guys had fun watching it. This was the intro that, that was supposed to happen, by the way, in the beginning, that never happened because it decided not to. So I'll show you this, but yeah, I, I had a great time with it, so I hope that you guys enjoyed it too, and I will see you in the next series because it's off to something else in the realm of Neo Geo. So take care, guys. I had fun. Bye.